Hi, it's Matt here from thatleisureshop.com. Have you ever wondered what chemical you need to go with your motorhome camper van or even a porta potty for a camping trip and why do you need it? Well, today in this video, I'm going to unpack some of the chemicals available to buy from the company Thetford. Now, if you've ever been to any camping accessory shop, you would have seen this range of colorful bottles from the company Thetford, who have been around forever, what it seems like it anyway. They were a company started in 1963 in Michigan in the USA, and they came to Europe in 1971, and they are all over Europe and the USA, and they are in most camping accessory shops. So we're gonna take a quick deep dive into the range of chemicals that Thetford make, designed specifically for your motorhome camper van caravan or porta potty trip. Now one of the first products we're going to talk about is the toilet roll from Thetford. Why would you buy this? Well, the big reason you would buy this is it's designed to dissolve effectively and quickly in a porta potty or a leisure vehicle toilet. It's two ply, it's soft, it's strong, but it dissolves fast. You can use it at home, but you will find it costs a little bit more than a high street supermarket. We sell loads of this and the rolls are actually very slightly smaller as well, so they're easy to store in a camper van or motorhome. So let's start with the toilet, seeing as the to toilet tissue has kicked us off. There's two colours of chemical that you would need to put in a porta potty or camper van toilet. There's blue and green, and you choose which one you're going to use. The big difference is the green is designed for use on campsites where there is a septic tank. Now in my experience, and there is some research that backs this up, is the green is not quite as effective as the blue. I think that's true. As I say, that's been my own experience, but the green is safe, biologically safe, to be poured into a sewer, which is going into a septic tank. How do you know if you're on a campsite with a septic tank? There's a great question. You'd have to ask the warden or the campsite owner. On the continent, the green is also sometimes a requirement. You're not allowed to use the blue. Now they do smell slightly different as well. They also come in two types of uh, form. So we've got liquid form and we've got sachet form. So I call these a toilet tea bag. They are pre-prescribed amounts. So the amount you use, gosh, <laughs> it's a strong smell. And it's a very different smell. The green and blue do smell different. So there's a, a green bag or a blue bag. So it's like a, you drop one of those tea bags into your toilet cassette or into your porta potty, add a little bit of water, litre or two of water, give it a shake and it's prepped and ready to go. You could also do a twin pack, which is blue and pink. Now the pink is also available to buy singularly. The pink is designed to go in the flush. So a lot of caravans and some older motorhomes have a header tank where you pour water into the header tank, you add a little bit of this, and then when you flush the toilet, it will flush around the bowl pink, which will clean the toilet pan. Some more modern motorhomes, certainly European motorhomes, don't have that header tank. They just draw water from the main water tank, so you're only flushing with water. So there is a pink spray that you can use, which looks a bit like this. We haven't got any here today, unfortunately, but you can spray that around the toilet bowl, which will keep it clean. This is a bathroom cleaner. Now, really important that this is bleach free. You must not use bleach in any motorhome or caravan or in, even on a porta potty plastic. It will stain and destroy the plastic over time, it turns it yellow. So, really important to use a bleach free cleaner. Thetford make a toilet duck, so you would be used to using one of these just to spray around the bowl. Really handy to keep the toilet clean as well. Slightly smaller than the ones you often find in supermarkets, so easier to store. And again, it's bleach free and designed for use with a plastic toilet. Cleaning the cassette, so this is where the poo and wee goes, and this is the treatment that goes in those, obviously. You need to keep that clean. This is a really great toilet cassette tank cleaner, uh, and it's designed, you pour this, I think there's four treatments in a bottle, some warm water, pour it in, fill the cassette, um, give it, leave it for 24 hours, give it a good shake and leave it, uh, and it will keep the cassette clean and free from smelling as well. Now these chemicals are all in the new format. This is the kind of old style, a big bottle. Thetford have introduced this concentrated range uh, and they've introduced a new smell for the blue. Now the toilet blue smell is a very distinct smell that many of us are very familiar with. This, that's, and it's referred to as lavender. Sounds romantic, doesn't it? Um, <laughs> you wouldn't want to drink it. The new smell is eucalyptus, and it is a breath of fresh air, if I can say that, if you know what I mean. It's a very different smell. It smells far less like a toilet chemical. Definitely worth exploring. If you're used to this old traditional smell, go and check out the new flavor, or I'm told I shouldn't say that, scent 
should we say, from Thetford, eucalyptus. Definitely worth checking out. Just sticking with toilets, this is a uh, silicon spray. So when you're using the motorhome caravan toilet, you're used to turning that lever, which opens the blade prior to use. This lubricates that rubber seal around that blade and just helps it keep it free moving. I would recommend using having a can of this and using it a few times a year, depending on how often you're using the motorhome toilet. Then we come to this orange bottle. This is a duo tank cleaner. So this cleans both the toilet cassette, so it kind of replaces this and it will also do your grey water tank. So the grey water is the water tank that's gone down the sink plug hole, hence there's a picture of a sink plug hole. So you've spat down it when you've cleaned your teeth, you've washed up and washed food down it, uh, you've maybe had a shower as well, so we've got soap, food and maybe toothpaste. That forms this kind of congealed mess in the bottom of the waste tank and this is really good at cleaning that. My recommendation is a dose of this, some four or five litres of water in the tank, ideally warm would be great and go for a drive, go and take it around around about a few times, leave it overnight and then empty it out and it will clean the tank and stop it smelling. There's also a grey water specific tank cleaner that just is designed to do the grey water tank whereas this one will do the toilet as well. So I hope that's been useful and help you explore the range of chemical from Thetford. It's a comprehensive range, you'll find them in most campsite shops or go and check them out on our own site at thatleisureshop.com.